what's up guys this is Yura Dynasty welcome to my channel and welcome to another video so today I'll be making a review regarding the uh, chain that I bought from Jacko G so if you watch my other video I made a comment over there that I wanted a, a black box and guess what <laughs> I don't know maybe they watch my video I got the block box thank you for that right then thank you Jakoji same thing as every review you guys watch comes with a box open a box comes with a the bag where your chain is and the certificate of authentication which is signed by Signed by once again by Raquel. Shout out to you, Raquel, for uh, packing my chain. Comes with a nice sticker too. Really appreciate it. I really thought Brayden when pack this chain because I seen on his story he actually tagged me about the chain that's being sent to. But it or it's fine. It's not a big deal. So that's done with the box and now I'll go check on the chain. So this is a flat curve 7 millimeter, 22 inches. Now buying this chain is one of the most hardest decision I have to make in my life. Because uh, at first I was supposed to buy the Miami Cuban and actually I did check out the Miami Cuban 6 millimeter, uh, 24 inches and then i was watching brayden's video and i was like i think i should just go all the way in for a seven millimeter so i emailed him if i can change my order for a seven millimeter miami cuban and then he emailed me back and he'll just cancel my order and i just have to order it again so as i was looking and i found this flat curve and so the here it is and i was like i was like thinking maybe i should just get the flat curve because uh um almost you can get the look uh it will save you thousands of dollars especially with all this pandemic right now i don't want to spend that much money plus holiday holiday uh, session season is coming in so i want to spend my money yeah so I want to spend money for my other loved ones and buy a chain for me. So it's a win-win uh, uh, situation. So that's what I did. And I was really, uh, the only concern I have when buying this is the gap compared to Miami Cuban. But you cannot really compare this to a Miami Cuban because this is a different kind of chain. But it's still a Miami Cuban. So let me just check this chain. Definitely get the weight. It shines like it shines like crazy. Look like it's still a diamond cut because it's like a because it's a double double field. For like the Cubans, they call this double filo. It give you that nice shine. It's very solid very sturdy stain a chain so let me just check on the on the lobster lock i'll give you a close-up of the it says over here 14 kt 14k carat the last chain i bought from him is just only say 14k this one says 14kt and on the back says italy on the other end it says there's a Jakoji logo in there. Which is a very nice touch. I really like that. And I I wanna look in between the in between the chain just to check the welding they did. Hmm, pretty nice chain. Pretty clean clean how they did it. It's supposed to be if Miami Cuban you, you wanna check the 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 drop test but this one will curve in the bottom I wanna see how straight it is nobody's been doing this on Jakoji Miami and it just start curving 
in the bottom but this is how it is made this is not Miami Cuban it will curve so I don't know I've been watching Miami Cuban uh, from Chakoji nobody's doing the straight test you guys should do that at least for people that want to see the Miami Cuban from Chakoji so here it is it's a very nice chain very solid chain Let's give you guys a close up. Very impressive. So if you guys are just like me, um debating if you want to get the Miami Cuban or or the flat curve. Um I let me just put this in my neck while I talk. I think at the end of the day, it's just like how flexible are you? Well, what's your budget? Because either or, because I'm telling, I guarantee that Miami Cuban is a lot more better. Imagine this on a Miami Cuban seven millimeter. I was supposed to buy the seven millimeter, twenty four inches Miami. Imagine that on, on this one. So, but nonetheless, if you're gonna buy this chain, it's still gonna get you that nice. Still can feel the weight. I'm gonna weigh this after. Oh, let me give you guys the neck profile of the seven millimeter. Flat curve, 22 inches. tuck in you still see a nice cold on the neck so if you don't wanna boom this joint is fire can't believe for this amount of weight for of grams and for the amount of money that you have to pay for this and will give you this nice look look at that joint you cannot complain on that look right there it's pretty and on Jacoji's flat curve they have a little bit tighter uh, gap compared to the other flat curves so plus I, I if you watch my other videos I know I said I wanted a uh, I always wanted a 24 inches so I can just go over my head but I needed a chain that's gonna be on me like everyday chain what I mean by everyday chain is like I'm gonna go sleep with it I'm gonna go shower with it like a chain is not gonna leave on my neck it's just gonna be on my neck every day so I'm thinking about buying the Miami Cuban with a uh, 7 millimeter even though if I can buy 22 on that one I think it's gonna be a little bit heavy for my everyday chain like chain I can just go sleep with so that's why I chose the flat curve because I needed a chain that is just gonna be on me and then if later on if I really wanted the Miami Cuban I will buy the 7mm 24 inches then I can have that um, two chain look in the future so I'm gonna weigh this chain right now it says on the certificate it's 38.38.4 I'm gonna weigh this chain alright here it is guys I'm gonna weigh the chain Thirty-seven grams. Hmm. It's supposed to say thirty-eight, thirty-eight point four. Let's do that again. Right there, thirty-eight grams. Thirty-eight grams for this nice flat curve. And in terms of the lobster lock, like everybody's concerned about, it's, it's very nice. It's very like well-made lobster lock. Plus it's big too. I remember on my 5mm rope chain, this is a lot more bigger lobster lock. Very nice, 30. There's 
five eight five I guess marking in there for Italy for saying it's a it's a fourteen carat. So I just wanna see the right there Jacoji logo. This is the other one. And for the fourteen carat right there. Italy right there. I just want to give you guys the really close up look for the lobster lock because I know a lot of you guys are concerned about this kind of lock and really that's why I want to go on that Miami Cuban for that box lock yeah that box lock is nice but nonetheless this is a nice lock too wheel made wheel wheels pretty nice look at the look at them want to really see you know in the middle on the chain look how nice and clean they did that right right there buying a flat curve is like buying a, a chain like a gold mirror I already actually I already used this so I, while I was driving the gold is just shining all over on my on my steering wheel on my roof it's just reflecting all over it's a very nice sturdy chain if if you're debating between flat curve or miami it just goes down on how what your budget is if you have that enough budget to go miami i also just go miami but if you want to uh, spread your money so you can buy other stuff for your loved, loved ones flat curve will not disappoint you you still get that nice look for the fair amount of price all right thank you guys for watching and see you to the next review please like and subscribe and if ever you have a question please comment below see you have a good day